Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Right now I will show you how to create the Taguchi method to select the optimum level of some data using Minitab. So Taguchi methods are statistical methods, sometimes called robust design methods, developed by Genichi Taguchi to improve the quality of manufactured goods and more recently also applied to engineering by a technology, marketing and advertising. So Taguchi's work includes three principal contributions right here to, this, to the statistic. First is a specific loss function. Second is the philosophy of offline quality control. And the last is innovations in the design of experiments. Now we have an experiment data, experimental data right here for consuming rice, fish, and meat which can result into run for some distances. And we have also arrayed in the Taguchi L9 array mo model. And we have, uh, and finally we have this table right now. Okay, now let's get started. How to process this data using Minitab with the Taguchi methods. Okay. Uh, so using this Minitab has many benefits, including easy to use, fast response, and also its accurate results. Okay, let's get started. Uh, first, uh, we click Start, and then select DOE, select Taguchi, and then we create Taguchi method designs. In the Taguchi design window, we select the tree level design and change the number of factors into tree and then click display available design button. We select the L9 design in the tree level, click in here, two until four, and then click okay. And then in the designs, we select the L9. Actually, we have two runs right here. First is L9 model, second is L27 model. I'm gonna use the L9 because it is easier. Okay, click okay and then click the factors button that has already activated and then now we change the name right here in a with the rice okay which we know that uh, the unit is in grams and then we uh, change the b factors to into fish c factor into meat and also we change the level values based on our data okay the first one is rice 225 250 and 300 double click in here we change it in 200 250 and 300 and also for the fish we look at our data once more 100, 125, 150, 100, 100, 100, okay, uh, double key in here, 100, 125, and 150, okay, we look at our data once more for meat, 150, 180, and 195. 150, 180, and 195. Okay, I'm gonna check once more that my data has been correctly. 125, okay, my data has been corrected. So then we just click OK. And then in the options, we just let the store design in worksheet has been checked right here. Click OK. And then we click OK. OK. In the table in the below, we have already our data uh, put in the mini tabs right here and has been modeled in the L9 array Taguchi table. And then in the results, we click in here and then we just type simply type it in kilometer distances kilometer distance okay and then for uh, 
easy things to do. If we have uh, a plot data in the Excel, it will be easier to so just uh, select all the data right here and then we con uh, hold the control button in the keyboard and then we uh, push the C button for uh, sorry uh, or we can select all and then we right click and then we just select copy okay what was wait a second okay and then we go back into the mini tab we paste in here okay we have all data has been plotted right here and then after that we if we want to analyze using tag g method we click stat again select doe and then select the tag g and then we select the analyze tag g design okay in the uh, uh, analyze tag design window we select the kilometer distance or in the c for column and then click select okay and then to, uh in the graphs which is select all of the data is like this and then in the analysis uh, we just keep the signal signal to noise ratios and means has been checked just let it be in the terms okay just let it be like this and the options we change from the default of nominal is best we change it into larger is better okay we just we click ok right here and then click ok once more no no wait uh we look at the storage i just let it be like this and then we just click OK. Wait until the mini tab process it. OK. Now res the result has come. And now we have our result right here in the response table for signal to noise ratios, which uh, uh, which has been selected for larger is better. We have we have uh, ranked in here that the rise is the most significant variable affected into the kilometer distance and then followed by fish and then meat and also we can see in the response table for means also the same the, the first rank is rice second fish and followed by meat and then we have also the main effects plot for means right here as we already know right here that uh, we have our optimum uh, uh, optimum factors or optimum levels uh, resulted by the Taguchi analysis that if we consume um, 250 grams of rice 150 grams of fish and 195 grams of meat we will have the most optimum kilometer distance uh, if we run okay this is also the main effects plot for SN ratios uh, it also gives the same uh, results that uh, in the rice it gives 250 grams in the fish it gives 150 grams and in the meat it gives 195 grams to produce uh the the best kilometer distance okay now we go into the regression model to look at the mathematical model okay we just click the stat and then click uh, select the regression regression select the regression once more and then click the fit regression model okay after the window has been opened we for responses we click the kilometer distance click select and then we uh, move into continuous predictors we hold the shift button right here okay we select the rise first and then we hold the shift button and we select all of the variables all of the factors rise mesh and fit uh meet sorry and then click select okay now we check one by one to, 
uh, the settings just let it be like this in the model and then click options just let it be like this coding okay graphs okay I just want to plot uh, in the individual plots I want to plot it in the normal probability plot for residuals and also parity diagrams right here click OK resource just let it be like this okay I will let all of this like this and then click OK all right now we have our regression equation or mathematical model right here to uh, create or to calculate the kilometer distance we have 2.37 minus 0.00227 multiplied by rise plus 0.00847 multiplied by fish and plus 0.0007 multiplied by meat so this is the constant to multi to multiple to be multiplied by uh, the factors values rice fish and meat okay and then the, in the ANOVA results we have a part of the chart right here of the standard diet effect and also our normal prob probability plot with the response is kilometer distance okay okay uh, I think that's all what I want to explain to you so keep yourself with me for the future videos and don't forget to like comment and subscribe okay thank you very much and have a good day